Also tonight, there are some new developments in the changing face of Nashville because ride sharing is officially here to stay. Yeah, and after months of debate, Metro Council put the city's final seal of approval on companies like Uber and Lyft. News Channel 5's Todd Walker was at tonight's council meeting and brings us reaction. Well, guys, while other cities are saying rideshare companies aren't welcome there, Nashville has embraced the idea with open arms. Tonight, they signed off on rules that make ridesharing a legitimate form of transportation in the city. It's a victory for, for Lyft and uh, for ridesharing in general. Um, just a validation of the things we were already doing uh, with our service, and now the city can feel confident uh, that everything that, that they were wanting to make sure of is being taken care of. Drivers will have to register every year with the city. They'll have to maintain a certain amount of insurance and their cars will have to be inspected. But those inspections just have to come from the parent company. We want to make sure all of our modes of transportation on Nashville streets uh, are safe and we know what's out there uh, and everything is uh, regulated. Now, there's no limit on the number of ride sharing cars on the road, but right now taxis are still limited and easing regulations on cab drivers and taxi companies will likely be the next step. We're expecting regulations on the golf carts you've seen zipping around town coming after the new year as well. Rory. Todd, thank you. Your pedal powered rides around downtown are also getting new rules. Metro Council passed regulations for pedicabs and pedal taverns tonight. Like ride shares, these drivers will also have to be registered and permitted by the city.